She's always told me my whole life just to be like, be good to people. That affected how I operate as an adult and like the values I hold. How my father treated me compared to how he was treated and kind of like broke that cycle and gave me the opportunity to like actually make the choices that I think are best for my life. You have to look, look, look after the family. You're not alone, so. When I became a father, uh, it opened up a new, a whole new world to, to me. Do you guys all play? I passed on the music to Cipriano. Cipriano passed it down to Cipriano as well. <laughs> Being around the loved ones is just this feeling that you can't explain. Just that you never want to let it go. understand that that you're not the only one and give our children well the world I guess My father's taught me so much. He's taught me my morals. You got that? Yeah, we got one over here too you can get. He's definitely taught me that hard work definitely pays off. Not just to work hard, but the value of your work, your work ethics. He felt more like brothers after he got older than we did father and son. Oh, I absolutely love my father. And I love my son too. Man, he's been a he's been a good life, but it was hard. You're getting your hands dirty. Oh, yes, sir. That's life. <laughs> and I want to thank you, you know, for teaching me everything that you have. That's a father's job. I appreciate you. I know you do. I feel it. Bless your heart. I was a sophomore of college. My nephews went into foster care. Uh, I got a call from DHS. Uh, I was the only one that would be qualified to take that. Where's your father? Uh, so I didn't grow up with a father or, or a father figure for that matter. A lot of the things I know about fatherhood I'm learning on my own, like um, uh, the boys are teaching me. As soon as I turned 21, they dropped him off at my apartment on uh, campus. There were times where I felt incapable. We do live in a very masculine oriented society that has so, so many expectations on men. Um, I think that me being queer and I had been able to like kind of remove myself from those heteronormative toxic masculine beliefs and it's really helped me a lot especially in relating to um, uh, my boys. Oftentimes when they leave home, I, I remind them, even when they're just going to school, uh, don't forget where you came from. How long have you guys been working together again? And we've been working together for 
25 years. Uh, I've owned it since 1962. Has it all been good? Oh, yeah. We have a special relationship, and that's transformed over into working. And uh, like I say, you got to take pride in what you're doing. you know, passing the business on the end. Well, like I say, I know one of these days the track's gonna run out. I love him and how much he means to me. I, I believe he knows that. If I didn't, you know, care that much about him and so forth, <laughs> I would find one way or another to get rid of him. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I can I, 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 I give my son all of me, you know what I mean? It gets the good parts as well as the bad. I just try to fix them. It's hard for me to describe to my friends now because when I seen that little boy come out, and looked at him, and he looked at me, and I held him for the first time. Like, I don't feel like I'll ever be able to even be the same person I was before that. What do you think it was? I, I felt like I didn't know what love was until then. And it made me realize what kind of a better person I want to be. That's really my end goal with it. It's just to be best version of self so that he can see what I am and be better than that. There's not gonna be another joy that you experience in life than raising your child. He's not just the father to me, he's my hero, my best friend, my everything. I owe it all to him as far as what he's told me. He's not, I can't thank him enough. I tend to view the divine being as a gentle and loving parent. If you're happy, I think that you've got the whole thing beat. Do you think that you're a good father? I put him before myself, and I feel like that's what a good father's supposed to do.